Hey everyone, in this quick tutorial I'm going to show you how to dynamically load and update icons in Grapes.js editor. Whether you are adding new icons or updating existing ones, this method will ensure your icons are always up to date. First, let's start by creating a function that will load SVG icons into the Grapes.js editor. Here is the add icon class to SVG function. This function takes the SVG content and an icon name, adds a class and assigns the icon name as a data attribute. This data attribute will help us to track the icon within the Grapes.js editor. Next, we need to fetch our icons from a JSON file. This JSON file contains all our SVG icons along with their names and descriptions. Once we have the icons, we pass each one to the add icon class to SVG function. We then check if the icon already exists in the block manager. If it does, we update the content. If not, we add it as a new block. I created my own React app to fetch icons from Figma and export them as a structured JSON file. Feel free to use it. You'll find the link in the description below. Now, here's the cool part. If an icon in the JSON file is updated, we want to ensure that the existing icons in the editor reflect these changes. We loop through all components with the data icon name attribute, find the corresponding updated icon, and replace the old SVG content with the new one if it's different. This ensures that all icons in your editor stay consistent with the latest updates. Adding new icons is just as simple. Drop the SVG content into icons.js file with a unique name and it will automatically be available in the block manager next time you load the editor. And there you have it. Your new icon library is ready to use. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more quick tips like this one. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.